Okay, read it to me again. The whole thing? Yeah, start the stop. Okay. It says, Dear customer, because you are involved in the trading of gold and equipment, ledgerlessly means playing with an alternate game client. Doing otherwise violates our policy of battle nest, <laughs> not funny, and Diablo 3. And it goes against the spirit of fair play and all of our games are based on. We strongly recommend that you avoid using any hack, cheat, vote, or explore. Exploit. Suspension and ban of players that have used or started using cheat and hack will... You can confirm that you are the original owner <laughs> of the account, the secure web. Log to this account in accordance, following oh. template, and verify your account. It's a link, but I'm not done. It says account name, account password, first and last name, secret questions and answers, show Please enter the correct information. If you ignore this email, this email, your account can your account can and will be permanent closed. Account security is incredibly important to us, and we hope that it is important to you too. If you have any additional security recommendations to add to this list. Please feel free to share them in the comment. <laughs> Account administration team, Diablo 3, World of Warcraft, Blizzard, Blizzard Infotainment. Just respond, F you. <laughs> when, so, I set, when I set that account up for you, I did not use your email. It's on one of my emails. So any email you get for Diablo 3 means nothing. They're, uh -huh. just, try, they're just trying to steal your account. Oh, I didn't know it was. Oh, well, when I start reading it, it says because you are involved in trading of gold and equipment. I thought, what the fuck are they talking about? Gold and equipment? What gold? You don't even know what equipment is. I don't even know what they're talking about. I thought, what the fuck are they talking about? And then when I start reading more of it, I'm thinking, what? They're going to ban me, suspend me. And then they turn around and say, and if you got any more information, you can just add it to the list. And I'm thinking, well, fuck, they should know all this shit. <laughs> Who are they accusing you again? Who are they accusing you of? Because you are involved in the trading of gold and equipment. Legitimately means playing with an altered game client. Doing otherwise violates our policy of Battle.net and Diablo 3. What the fuck is Battle.net? I don't even know what that is. And it goes against the spirit of fair play that all of our games are based on. We strongly recommend that you avoid using any hack. Are you See? hacking your client? I don't even know how to hack. If I knew how to fucking hack, I'd hack and go and uh, take all my bills out. <laughs> Hack, cheat, bot. I don't even know what bot is. Yes. <laughs> what the fuck is bot? Or exploit? What? Exploit what? What? Is, what am I exploiting? And it says, mention and band of players that have used or started using cheat and hack will. That's all they say. Will. And then it's the other line. It continues by saying. You can confirm that you are the original owner of the account to this secure website with what? Then it says log in to your account in accordance following template. What the fuck's a template? To verify your account. Well, they give me a link to click, right? Don't click it. I'm not. And then they say account name, account password, first and, first and surname. Secret questions and answers? What the fuck secret questions? I can't tell you. It's a secret. And it says, show, please enter the correct information. If you ignore this, this email, your account can and will be closed permanently. Account security is incredibly <laughs> important to us. I think I'm going to go play Diablo. I haven't played that in a while.
Well, send me the link. <laughs> they well, gave well, you one. <laughs> and then it says, important to us, and we hope that it is important to you too. If you have any additional security recommendations to add to the list. Yeah, you've read it. Okay, I understand. 